All right, just in. FBI announces death of Lee Andrew Edwards, Bola Tinubu's conciliary in Chicago drug rig. The Federal Bureau of Investigation has told a federal court in the United States that a former Chicago mobster with ties to Bola Tinubu has passed on. The U.S. body said this on Wednesday as part of its latest update in an ongoing Freedom of Information lawsuit before the United States District Court for the District of Columbia in Washington, D.C. In light of receiving information that appears to confirm Mr. Edwards' death, there has begun its search for responsive records pertaining to him, the U.S. authorities said in court filing. Officials did not say when and how Mr. Edward died, even though the revelation was framed in a way that suggested it might affect the timeline of future disclosure in the ongoing matter. The announcement followed the government's effort to conceal information relating to Tunibus' involvement in an expansive drug business in Chicago. The government had previously released documents that showed Mr. Edwards alongside Mr. Tinubu was a prominent member of a drug mafia that operated in the northwestern USA in the 1980s. Investigators believed Mr. Tinubu was a leader of this syndicate at the time. But the documents relating to Mr. Tinubu are still being concealed with the FBI submitting contradictory statements to the court. Aaron Greenspan, a public transparency activist who filed the Freedom of Information suit in collaboration with Nigerian journalist David Hundein, said the FBI has been downplaying the volume of records relating to the Nigerian president in its possession. The FBI and other federal authorities, I have not conducted an adequate search and are on the press on the representing the number of pages responsive to Mr. Green's plans request, he told the court in the joint study report entered on December 5, 2023. The FBI has released hundreds of pages of records relating to Mr. Tinubu's associates, including Mr. Edwards and Adeboyega Muez Akainde. The entire file released so far was completely edited to remove Mr. Tinubu's name or clues as to his role. Mr. Greenspan urged the court to order the FBI to release the records promptly and exhaustively with Mr. Tinubu's name and role. He cited the Chicago already public case file that detailed how Mr. Tinubu forfeited over $460,000 in narcotics proceeds as evidence that the FBI's file on Mr. Tinubu can no longer be concealed. Please do not forget to like, comment, and share. We pray for the happy repose of Mr. Edwards, and we pray that justice will be done. In Nigeria, we have the type of president they always wished for. We need good governments. We need good democracy. Peace to everyone. Don't forget to like, comment, and share. Thank you very much.